Hello people, welcome to my channel Rereads and it's the 1st of September, woo, I'm so excited because it's my birthday month, but first we're going back in time to August, um, I'm doing my August wrap up, um, I don't, I'm doing my, I'm doing TBRs a little bit different, I'm, I'm scrapping TBRs, I can't get, I can't show you a big pile of books and not get through them. So I've decided a little bit differently that I was going to choose one book out of my TBR packet and read that and try and get through that in the month and if I got through that in the month then choose another book to read. Um, I went to, I did, I went, I was trying to get through the Curious is Still Double the Night Time but I couldn't get through it because I read it so much. So um, I decided to go to my local library and I got, I've read my first graphic novel of 2000, my second graphic novel of 2014 um, and it's based on a well best-selling book and this is kind of a um, August wrap-up slash review review because um, I'm going to um, I read this took me about two days I got it from the library read half of it and then read the other half the next day it's based on a book and it's the graphic novel of the kite runner by Khalid Husseini Oh my god, I really enjoyed this. I have. Let me just say, I have not read the book. Um, now I'm planning on reading the book, so the book's going to be different to the graphic novel. The graphic novel novel was this, and it was a great introduction to the kite runner. Excuse me, I'm just going to let my dog out. There we go. Anyway, this was a great introduction to the kite runner, and yes, I am going. I am planning on reading the book. Um at some point in the future but I really enjoyed this as for what it was I love the pictures I just want to show you these pictures I just love these pictures I love the pictures I love the artwork it was great the story was really sad in places I really enjoyed the story I kept up with the story I really want to re I really want to re reread this again but I want to read it at a slower pace because I felt I probably missed stuff because I really enjoyed the story so much I got really into it um, this is about, I'm going to read you the back of this. So, 1970s Afghanistan, 12 year old Amir is desperate to win the local kite fighting tournament and his loyal friend Hassan promised to help him. But neither of the boys can foresee what will happen to Hassan that afternoon, an event that is to shatter their lives after the Russians invade and the family is forced to flee to America. Amir, re Amir realises that one day he must return to an Afghanistan under Taliban rule to find the one thing that his new world cannot grant him, redemption. That is just amazing. It, this book is amazing. It deals with so so many, um, so much struggles that went on in the 1970s Afghanistan. It deals with, um, it has a scene. Um, I don't, this, I found this in the teenage section. I think it's more older, older teenagers like nine you know like um 16 up it deals um with quite uh, quite horrendous things in this book um i think if you've read it if you've read the book and if you've, you've read the graphic novel i think you know what i mean because i don't want to spoil it for you um it deals with um death it deals with um you know having to live in another country having to go away and living in another country um it deals with having to live in a country where you get blown up um, having to deal with living with, you know, living with all the things, and in and entwined in such a lovely story of a boy who helps his friend to fly, you know, to win a kite tournament. <laughs> that is to win a kite tournament, and you know, it's such a lovely story. So I devoured this in this in August, and I recommend I would recommend this book, this graphic novel, to anyone who has. Um, you know, to anyone who has read the book or seen the film and, you know, just wants a different take on this story. This was my first take on this story, so I'm going to read the book and then I'm going to watch the film. So I have three different takes, three different, you know, takes on the story. Because the book will be different from the graphic, no graphic novel. Um, my, I think my favourite five things about this book is the artwork, is the story, the, the, the plot is so good. Um, the issues that that come from this story story really got me thinking you know and sometimes reading a graphic novel adaptation from a book brings the characters to life so those are my five things i liked about the book the pictures the plot the issues um the setting and you know 
how and the bringing the characters to life. I that, those are my five things I liked about the book. Um, so yes, that was the Kite Runner by Khaled Hosseini, and there we are in its in its full glory. Um, now I'm going to um, tell you what I want, which book slash books <laughs> I want. To, I would like to like to read in September. My first book. My first priority is going to be getting myself through Alice in Wonderland. I've already started. I love it. I love my edition of Alice in Wonderland. I like the illustrations. Um, I just wanted to show you that. That is the front page. That how can you? That is gorgeous, isn't it? Um, I'm really enjoying this at the moment. Um, I'm looking for. I'm looking forward to um, devouring this in the month of September and then telling you all about it. And I'm also reading, um, I think it's called The Long Earth by Stephen Baxter and Terry Pratchett. I'm really enjoying that book at the moment. Um, it's got, it's a, it's a bit time travelly. It's other worlds. I'm really enjoying it. It's a really great read at the moment. I think I'm like page 23. So yes, so those are the two books that I'm reading in September. I hope you enjoy your month of reading. Please do let me do let me know what you thought of the Kite Runner in the comments below. That was just such, such a fantastic, fantastic graphic novel. I'm so glad I picked that up from my library. It was such a treat. I just want to show you the pictures again, just because I can. They they are gorgeous, gorgeous illustrations. Um, just to let you know who illustrated this book, um, it was illustrated by Fabio Fabio Chiloni and Micra and Andolov. Oh, sorry if I can't pronounce your names but yes book of the month book of all book of the month of august was the kite runner do pick it up please do read it and do let me know what you think thought about it in the comments below i will see you soon in my next video bye bye